So if you've noticed less milk or eggs or other farm products in your grocery store, it's not just because consumers were going to stores in droves preparing for the storm. It's also because farmers like those here at Cranick Dairy in Enumclaw are having a hard time getting their goods to market. That's in part because the trucks have had issues getting to and from farms and to the grocery stores because of all the snow. Out here they got 18 inches of snow over the last week. That means all kinds of precautions they have to take for keeping the cows safe or making sure their water doesn't freeze over to making sure the cows are comfortable. The snow that we've had these last few days has definitely created challenges not just for dairy farmers but all farmers and we've had to plan ahead a lot with our feed making sure our employees get come to work but first and foremost is cow comfort. Do we leave the cows outside? Do they have enough to eat? Are their barns safe for them? Are they clean? And most importantly we need to keep them on their regular milking schedule. We have to make sure if we don't have power and our power went out a couple times, we have generator backup. We need to keep our milking parlor going and then we need to sell that milk too. And so we need to make sure that our refrigeration works to cool that milk down. Consumers shouldn't be too surprised to go to their store and see the, the milk cooler not as filled up as it normally is and we're doing everything we can to make sure that people do have food to eat and it's not just milk but it's also any of your perishables including eggs and produce. Uh, we're working on it. We're working hard. The folks here at Cranick Dairy say they're used to this kind of adversity. They got snow like this just two years ago. They're asking consumers to just be patient. They expect that it will all return to normal in about a week. In Enumclaw, I'm Allison Morrow, King 5 News.